Well, I'm turning around. I already turned around. Good motor test, I guess. My motor keeps fluctuating. My RPMs keep uh, kind of falling off and then hooking back up and falling off again. And I'm not sure why. So, erring on the side of caution, I figured I should probably turn it around since I don't really know how to sail. If I lose my motor, I'm, I'm going to learn how to sail real quick, right? I mean, everything seems pretty good other than these fluctuations in my RPM. Keep it under, you know, keep it about 25, 2600, but uh, it'll drop down to about two grand. And I'll have to give it more throttle, and then it'll rev right up, it'll respond, but I don't know why it's falling off. And that's, uh, that's disconcerting. Mount Rainier way over there. Lots of, uh, uh, it's pretty blue sky. Nice big chemtrail swaths floating around. I've, I got about a quarter of the way to swim there. Uh, I think this is Bainbridge Island right here. There are some rich mofos that live on that island. Each one of these houses is a few mil. What are all these millionaires doing there? Just sitting in there, sitting in there, you living room watching TV, just like everyone else, <laughs> most likely, except they're planning their nice vacation, while well, most people are just, that is their vacation, just watching TV. moving them averaging about five and a half miles an hour I sure would like a better prop I can't help but think that if I had a little more thrust on the prop I could, uh, I could get a little more speed out of her when I'm motoring I mean, it'd be nice to be able to motor at a decent clip although it is a sailboat Aye, aye, aye. I think what I need is a uh, the furling jib. Then I could jib sail. But I, I've got the old setup here. I don't have any of the furling drums. So, you know, I, I don't doubt I could get my jib sail up there. But, you know, the wind changes and I'd have to switch it to the other side. I'm just not completely hip on all that yet, unfortunately. Come on, motor. Keep running. We got about another, you know, 45 minutes. I'll be back at port. And I guess uh, strap her down and ride the gold wing back to Vancouver and figure it out from there. I really want to get out of this place. You know, this. This. I had trouble sleeping last night. I wasn't feeling too good, although my neck's not killing me so bad today. That's good. Uh, but I just... My ears would ring like mad. Every time I'd wake up, I'd wake up to... In my ears. And just loud, loud tinnitus. Yeah, tinnitus. Is there such thing as real tinnitus? I really doubt it. Just ringing like mad. It didn't help that every time I go to sleep, I kept having dreams about my rotten ex-girlfriend. I love dearly, but she don't love me. Boy, she like gets off on getting one over on me. Ha <laughs> ha! Fooled you. You thought I cared about you. you know, that's that's what I get from her every time. Much crap. I guess I need to learn how to sail proper. I can leave this crap hole country. You 
USA, what a fucking joke. No. There's gotta be some place in the world that's not a fucking diseased, infested fucking shithole where they're spraying you with poison 24 hours a day. Fuck, I'd rather live in a fucking third world country where the, the ruthless dictator reserves the right to kill everybody for no particular reason and live in a place where I know I'm being poisoned to death. You know? <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> At least if the ruthless dictator comes to kill you, it'll be over quick. Looking at where the water is, in, make sure I'm not riding any lower in the water. It still looks the same, so I'm good. Uh, I've got to go through there, around there, over there, and up into that corner. Come on, baby, keep on going. I'm talking about the RPMs keep <laughs> fluctuating. They go up, they go down, they go up, they go down. Drop. Say, what's going on? 